This was the first time we'd ever tried this and um, I think it was kind of, to explain the concept, it was just literally in my industry, World Sight Day is really well known. So with Gordon, my partner, owning this place, we, we thought we'd do something a bit quirkier. One of the ideas was that I knew a bunch of business people, not all who had been able to get in here, and um, it was just cool to be able to invite them to an event like this. Good to see so many people getting out here and supporting it. Just, I say, real thrill. I got invited by Gordon and Amanda, and you know, an excuse to drink for a cause. Well, it's highballs for eyeballs. Gordon came up with highballs for eyeballs, so then we needed a highball to go with this evening. And um, based on the Japanese G&T, which was pro uh, the drink that Midori launched um, with in America, we basically just tweaked that a bit, added some kiwi fruit, so it looked like eyes in the highballs, and that became our drink of the evening. I love the marketing concept of uh, highballs for eyeballs. I thought it sounded fantastic. Considering tonight is all about uh, World Sight Day, and the challenge, and tonight's called Highballs for Eyeballs. Took it upon myself to accessorise accordingly with some uh, eyeballs, also in the Shore Optical green colours. Do you like? It's always lovely to join in with other like-minded people who are willing to support a great cause. I'm a friend of Amanda's from Shore Optical, and she's my optometrist as well. I love to come here and, and have a cocktail and chill out before I head home to Terrigal. So, lovely spot, nice chill vibe, and, and recommend a place to anyone. Yeah. Oh, I absolutely love the vibe. I love the fact that it's fantastic cocktails. I love the fact that it's one of the few venues and the Central Coast that promotes high quality. Um, it's going back to the original roots of bartending. It's got such a great atmosphere and uh, and lovely people, great service. Uh, Barman's not bad looking either. We, we, we figure that you know we get uh, sort of a, a good amount of support, but both Amanda and I have just been blown away by, by everything that's coming through. And, and I think it's a great venue and I just hope the, the local community, particularly the business CBD, get behind it. Everyone in the room knows Amanda. She's um, the owner of um, Shore Optical out there at Lizaro. Uh, she's putting on this wonderful little shindig tonight. Um, and her partner, Gordon Ryan, who has given this beautiful space um, to hold this um, wonderful event in tonight. So thank you both for, for doing this. And the reason we are here tonight, um, folks, is it's the inaugural Highballs for Eyeballs. Highballs for Eyeballs is basically the fundraising event for World Sight Day. It's a challenge that, um, that has been set to um, optometrists. Um, I'll let Amanda and Gordon talk about their targets and um, you know, hopefully we will even exceed that $1,200 collectively. I am sure we will, I'm sure we can triple it. I'm saying we dig deep <laughs> and um, we'll have a little bit of fun in the, in the, in the process. <laughs> in the fundraising game, Amanda. <laughs> I think based on tonight, um, everybody seems to have had an awesome time, which is really important to me and Gordon, as far as Reviver's concerned, um, that people enjoy the space. So I think we'll probably make it an annual event, I think. I think that'll, that'll probably be the outcome. And I, apparently we've already exceeded my target, we've apparently already exceeded Gordon's target. Apparently we're getting close to the target that Shannon from Westback Rescue Helicopter set for us, so that's going to be awesome for Optometry Giving Site. The targets we set in terms of fundraising, we've just smashed them and so we're really, really thrilled.